Hello everybody, Lava Captain 2000 here, and welcome to my new Let's Play. Captain 2000 here, and welcome back. Well, not welcome back, I guess, but welcome to my new Let's Play. The Let's Play of Star Wars Republic Commando, one of my favorite games of all time. So, yeah, uh, this game was created about the same time period as the Battlefront games, uh, and it has the distinction of being one of the most unique approaches to the uh, concept of a tactical third-person shooter. Uh, yeah, no, the mouse is really finicky here. So yeah, um, Republic Commando is our next project. It is significantly shorter than Battlefronts 1 and 2, and I will give it that much. Uh, going over the main menu and what we will be covering, we'll be doing a full playthrough of the entire game. Uh, this includes uh, the entirety of the campaign, as well as possibly checking out multiplayer if I can get somebody to help. We'll also be looking at the extras at the end of the project as well. I intend to go over as much of this game as humanly possible, and this is going to be a very I don't know if it'll be a different LP, but it's certainly going to be an LP much more in the same vein of uh, Resident Evil 7. And it's honestly comparable to RE7 in the fact that it is a game designed basically to uh, function as a grunt version of Star Wars. Now, uh, before we do anything, I'm actually going to go ahead and... What was that? What was that? Uh, uh, music volume right now. All right, cool. Uh, we will bring back the music volume. Don't worry. Uh, I and, and this is one of the uh, games similar to Star Wars Battle, uh, not Star Wars Battlefront, uh, just shapes and beats, and that I'm probably going to let the music play, even though it's copyrighted. All of this stuff is owned by Lucas Arts and by extension Disney. Uh, but this is also technically Legends, so if they copyright it, it means it's canon. So there you go. Anyway, uh, I am going to go ahead and, uh, no, uh, do not do that. Let's go over here. And I'm going to go over and talk about difficulty. Now, this game is hard, and I'm going to probably get some flack for this, but I'm actually going to be playing this on easy mode. Uh, this is for two reasons. Number one, even on normal mode, the game really kicks your ass. And on easy mode, it kicks your ass just the right amount for it to be a fun, enjoyable experience, but not one that is mind-numbingly hard. I will not be playing this on hard because it's masochistic. So we're going to be playing this on easy mode. On top of that, we're also going to be getting uh, subtitles because I don't know. And I think that's actually all we need to do for stuff. Let me check. Alrighty, I actually think we have gotten everything that we need to get started. So, without being said, let us hop right into the campaign. The beginning. Welcome, little one. This is your first day. Your designation will be RP-01-138. We expect great things from you. You have been born into dangerous times. A sharp mind can be the key to survival. But as often as not, it will be your inherent physical traits that win the day. And in this regard, you will be superior to your more common brethren.
For you are a commando, an elite unit, something truly special. Your weapons, your armor, and most importantly, your brothers. The Eifer of our world hunt in pods to bring down much larger prey. So too shall you join with three brothers and become fierce hunters for the Republic. Now, join your pod and embrace your destiny as their leader. Join Delta Squad. Delta Foro, your foundation. A pure and uncomplicated soldier. 6-2, the heart and soul of your team. And 07, the fiercest hunter of all your brothers. You are each a piece of a whole person. And the Republic will call you to defend and give your lives if need be. on Geonosis. See you planet side, sir. Our third time in zero hour. All right. I love this. Welcome to Geonosis 38. It's nice to see they finally unhooked you from the simulators. I've been assigned as your advisor and will be your eye in the sky until further notice, or we all get killed. Once you're on the ground, you will rendezvous with Delta Squad. Delta 6-2 is nearby. Your first objective is to find him and link up. The squad objective remains. Find Sun Fak and eliminate him. I will be issuing further orders as you go. Good luck, Commando. Exposition! Alrighty, so Star Wars Republic Commando is split up into three missions, but each mission is set up into, for the lack of a better term, four to six mini segments. Each segment is decently length, and I will be trying to do one segment per video. Uh, this means that today we are doing uh, Extreme Prejudice which is this mission right here. So this video is going to be a bit longer than normal. Uh, Gene Ocean, L Chief Lieutenant Sun Fak must be eliminated. Delta Squad has been inserted separately into the war-torn gladiatorial arena and points beyond. They must rendezvous and effect Sun Fak's removal by, by any means necessary. Uh, can I pot? No, I cannot, because I really need to turn down the sensitivity before I start shooting things. So let us begin. Okay, we're above the LZ. Hook in. Look out! Ah! I will be providing you with support and tactical information as necessary. Tactical information will be displayed on your heads-up display as holographic projections. Text communications will be displayed in this area. area position. Here are your orders. Your primary target is the Geonosian leader, Sun Fak. Delta lead, it is absolutely vital that Sun Fak not escape. Alright, uh, let's... 
let's do something real quick. Be right back. Delta lead, are you alright? You just took an anti-infantry round. Your vitals don't look very good. Heal Hi. yourself with Vector before you go any further. There's a medical station in your vicinity. Alrighty, so, uh, I'm going to continue without hints. So, in this game, uh, we have basic moves. Uh, WSAD is walking. I'm using the keyboard variation. Proceed to the next Vector station and plug in. You'll see a tall device with a cross on it. Sir. Just get us inside without killing the squad, okay, Scorch? Heads up, squad. Audio is approaching your position. The charge is set and ready to detonate. It's all yours, boss. Fence's position. Yes, sir. Uh, Take offensive formation. Yes, sir. Let's form up. Forming up, boss. Advisor, we've got some heavy artillery over here. Gunship Hawking, en route. Bogey's here. I'm out. Reloading. Let's form up. Forming up, boss. Holy crap. Press on 
commandos. I will continue to monitor your progress from the gunship and provide you with information as necessary. Reinforcements are currently unavailable, so watch each other's backs in there. So, uh... Alright, so now that we are... Remember, Delta Lead, your ultimate objective is Sunfac, but your immediate objective is to rendezvous with Delta 4-0. Delta Squad forming up. Forming up, boss. Alright, so, a few things. First of all, this weapon... 6-2, taking position. Hush, Scorch. Uh, so this weapon right here is the DC-17 Blaster <laughs> Rifle. Uh, this is your primary weapon in all instances. Uh, it holds up to 300 rounds. And I think it fires in clips of six, so it can shoot six clips maximum from a full thing. We didn't get to see it, but we also have this. This is the DC-17 pistol attachment, the same one in the intro of this video. Uh, this is your secondary weapon. It has no ammo recharge whatsoever. Oh, let me do that. Uh, however, it is lower damaged than anything else in the game. Uh, for your DC-17 weapon, if you use your melee button, you will throw out a vibration knife. This is easily the most valuable tool you have in your, uh, in your kit at the very beginning of the game. Uh, the pistol does not have that. Instead, when you are using the pistol, you will perform a pistol hit. Well, you'll just hit somebody with the back end of your gun. Uh, we have grenades. Uh, grenades are color-coded based on what they do. Red grenades this are basically pointless. Just... Let's get moving. Fine, I'll walk while we talk. Uh, red grenades are thermal detonators. They function like your basic frag grenades. So yeah. Uh, there are commandos. Get rid of the things trying to kill us, and this ain't such a bad place. 6-2, taking position. Yeah, I know. She's on the mark. Good one. Delta 4-0 is on the other side of this door. Place a charge and blow it. I'll warn him to step back. So Need some cover, squad. That's not what you said, Scorch. So despite I them being specialists, explosives. despite them being specialists, um, any commander can The charge can is set and ready to detonate. It's all yours, boss. Any commander can perform any task. It's clear. Uh, I hope that some... Oh, wait. <laughs> Uploading and linking with your visor, sir. Alright. Um... Delta lead, advise your task 4-0 with slicing that security shield. He is supremely qualified. So yeah, Your anyone... squad status and location is displayed here. Ah! Okay, Working. good. Uh, any commander can perform any task as well as anyone Quest else. Quest complete, sir. Security shield disabled, we're in. And you can also Moving do to tasks cover. as well. Uh, it's just that... You, you're probably the best. Now, on my way. Perfect shot, Commando. Uh, these guys are just warriors. They are a really old class of enemy. And they aren't that bad. Delta squad pulling up. Got your back, 3-8. They are very good. You're nearing a secure door leading to the hangar. Activity in the hangar suggests that they are unaware of your presence. I advise slicing the controls to this door and entering quietly via a door slice maneuver. Nice hit, boss. Uh, even though, um... Slice that door, Delta. Affirmative, sir. You can do about everything on your own. Uh, it's much easier to get AI to do it because you're easily the best shot in your squad. The your teammates Click. can do pretty good. Click. In the right scenarios, your commandos are as effective at killing things as you work. are. It's just that you have the benefit of being a human, they don't. We got warriors here. Defend this position. Let's form up. Right, right. Right. Target ahead. Fire the hole! We've located a pair of Gen Ocean fighters. Man, I need to turn down that sensitivity a lot more. Don't want them to be used against us. Destroy them. Target, upload it to your objective tracker. Right. Let's form up. Forming oh, up, boss. Oh, sorry, Scorch. Cover me. 
Charge armed and ready. Take cover, Delta. Uh, do you think we used enough? Good shot. It's getting a little dark here. Delta Squad, switch to Vitha mode. Let's form up. Forming up, boss. Take offensive formation. Switching to night vision. Uh, as we slowly clear out this wave of enemies... Delta Squad forming up. Forming up, boss. We are just gonna... Yeah. Federation yeah. mech destroyed. Dead mark confirmed. Excellent. Alright. And I'm gonna go ahead and go over here, grab this. Switch off that visor, Delta. It's plenty bright in here. Aye, sir. Nice move, sir. Good. Now use the demo oh, charge to clear the path. <laughs> Alien blow. Reloading. Secure that area. Yes, sir. We got geos, Delta. I can't rush this, you know? Uh, we don't have to rush this to get it in. It's hot, boss. Secure that position. Yes, sir. Get clear. Target annihilated. Delta squad forming up. Forming up, Delta sir. lead. You need to keep your squad focused and under your direction. Use your squad commands to get results. Uh, the squad command... We've intercepted communications from Sunfax planning room. He's located one level below your current position. The Geonosians are aware of your presence and are on high alert. Expect heavy resistance. Excellent shot, sir. Confederate okay. So, uh... Evaluate. Uh, Let's form up. Forming up, boss. Uh, the squad commands are those, uh, weird hands. Let's down. Uh, we're almost done with the first level. Uh, as you can see, I'm moving at pretty The opening at the end of this hall is directly above Sunfax planning room. You can repel down from the ledge. Roger that. Let's get down to the lower level. Alright. Delta lead, squadmate 07 is now in your vicinity and remaining covert. Proceed with caution. 07 locking into your hut, sir. Getting acquainted with the locals, eh, Sif? That was fun. Where's Sunfak? In the next room, boss. And don't worry. I saved some targets for you guys. Alright, we have a new type of grenade. Moving to cover. Awaiting orders. Uh, blue frag grenades, or I think they're called uh, EMP ones, are designed specifically to neutralize droids. Yes, we'll be seeing droids. Shocking, I know. Anyways, uh, that glowing box right icon right there is Sunfak. And uh, this is actually the full squad, <laughs> believe it or not. So yeah, we've got a demolitions expert, we've got a slicer, and we've got a sniper. Let's breach! Sunfak is making a run for the door. Stop him! He's made it through! Delta lead. It is absolutely vital that Sunfak not escape. Yes, I know. Uh, when we walk in this door, be prepared to fight something. We've got... Fucking oh, yeah. oh. Eliminate Super battle droids. droids! We've got a super battle droid! Come on, let's train your squad's fire on single targets to penetrate their armor. 6-2 powering up. Yeah, but this is not super battle droids. Or just super battle droids. Super battle droids. Snip it up, 3-8. I'm reading a power transfer to Sunfax fighter. Roger that. There's really two ways to kill the, uh... Uh, One is this way. Eliminate the target. Down to the trick, 38. Uh, but the way that works is Delta, better, begin door breach. Aye, sir. The way that works Aye, a lot better is by uh, stabbing them with your knife. Clear. Because B2s have problems with C2. Ready to roll. Go! Yes. Oh, yes. There he is, outside the shield. Delta lead, assign 07 to sniper position. We need a target on Sunfac. Alright. Sunfac is making a run for it. Sunfac's fighter is warming up. Delta, what are you doing? <laughs> He's taking off! Now you're lost! Sunfax dead. All I smell is burnt Geonosian. 
3-8, my scanners show an explosion. That's affirmative. Subject terminated. Did you see that? That craft didn't look to ocean. Confirmed. It's unidentified. I'll check the intelligence databanks. Move on, Deltas. There's no time to celebrate, Deltas. As you already know, 3-6, the squad has been incapacitated. Their mission was to disable the droid factory in this sector. Your squad has been retasked for this purpose. Proceed to the elevator. All right, and with that, we have actually finished our first mission. Uh, so yeah, we're going to talk about that ship much later in the story, but that is the very first mission. And holy crap, for a tutorial mission, that's a lot happened. That's a general of the Gene Ocean Army dead. We've got reunited with the squad. We, uh, we, we, we did pretty good. Anyway, that is going to do it for this episode. Next time on Star Wars Republic Commando, we are going to be completing, uh, infiltrating the, uh, Separatist Droid Factory as the clone army advances on the rest of the separatist forces why is that out of place i don't know i'm talking about real world things now uh until then please leave a like comment subscribe follow me on twitter if that's something you would like to do and i will see each and every one of you lovely people in the next video bye guys